This walk starts at Peronia Park on the western side of the Inco River, and the walk follows the river to the north to North Ride. The start of this walk takes along Peronia Avenue, just next to the uh, children's playground. And once we get to the end of the road, we follow the trek. This trek eventually leads us down to the very end of Princess Street. From here we get nice views across Lane Cove River. We follow the street up the hill for about 50 metres before turning off at the next Great North Walk sign. We follow this track along across Brickmakers Creek and up along the boardwalks. We eventually arrive at uh, a little deviation out to the edge of the mangroves. Returning back to the track, we head up the steps. I thought this rock was rather interesting. For such a big rock, there's not much holding it there. We soon come to the viewing platform. This wouldn't be a bad little place to stop and have a rest. There's a seat there. Back on the track, we go along some more boardwalks, then walk along the side of this rock wall. From here we follow along Buffalo Creek, along some boardwalks. Eventually coming out at uh, the Buffalo Park. Here again we follow the north uh, walk signs. And we soon come to the track head. This would be a bad place for a break as well. From here we'll follow the track down the steps and along the boardwalk. Out through the mangroves. Then we follow the track along using the bridge crossing Buffalo Creek and we'll head up the hill. Soon we get to the top of the climb, we come to a T intersection where we'll turn right. Once we come to another intersection, we'll follow the track down towards the Pitwater Road car park. On the way, we pass these rather well, large concrete pylons for the par lines crossing Lingo River. 
walking our way around that center we soon come down to the exit to the national park and heading down towards Pitwater Road we'll turn to the right and follow the track down walking along the edge of the mangroves We cross Kitty Creek and follow the track along to the right. And soon we leave the bush and come out into an open area. This is Magdala Park. There's various sports grounds. We cross the, p the park and on the other side we join a track going down uh, to the footbridge across the Inco River. The footbridge uh, follows along next to a large water pipe. This footbridge is around 150 metres long and takes us over the river and over the factory, the starch factory. Isn't it amazing how pigeons around the world will always find where there's food? From here we come out on the Epping Road. Again we take the main bridge over the Inco River, take the steps down and then go underneath the bridge, crossing to the other side and following the Great North Walk signs. We should come to a nice little rock face with beautiful tree ferns. Hi, well we're almost at the end of this walk. As uh, often happens when I'm in the bush in Sydney, I'm pleasantly surprised by the state of the, of the treks. They're in good order. They're pretty wet because of all the rain we've had, but it's good to see all these treks being used and well looked after. I really enjoyed this. I guess there's one drawback for this walk is the fact you never get away from the traffic noise. Hey, but then we're in the, in the business centre of Northern Sydney. Isn't it fantastic? Come down and do this nice walk. It's very pleasant. Soon we have to leave the Great North Walk and head up towards the business centres. You can see the large buildings just behind the vegetation. We follow the roads around and after about a kilometres walk we come to North Ride Railway Station. The walk complete.